Welcome to see how to create a board in Clamit. Learning areas or boards are created in the My Boards tab. All boards created or co-created by you will be found here. To create a board, just click on the Create a Board button. The first thing you need to do is give your course an informative headline. I'm going to copy mine over here. And the next thing you want to do is give a good description of your board. You can, for example, tell your learners what your board is about, some learning goals, some things that they should be expecting. Planet uses HTML tags to make reading easier. So that means that you can bold your text, add headlines or even links. I have created my board description that I'm going to copy in here. And after this, you have a few options. So the first option is to enable tracking. Um, this means that you're able to see, for example, what pieces of content your learners have uh, completed, maybe what they're still missing. We always recommend enabling this because this will obviously help you follow the progress. And also by enabling this, you can give grades and a certificate to your learners to thank them for their hard work. After this, you may want to hide your learners or you have the option to do so. This could be useful if you have a really big course and you don't want learners to get uh, to see the list of people attending your course. Um, after this, you can add a board cover picture and a background picture. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Select my picture and select the other picture. I'm just going to use the same ones here. Now you have two options after this. Either you can save your board or we can look at the sharing options. And um, let's take a look at those. So if you don't share your boards to anyone, they will be personal boards. If you just click on save, it will just be a board that only you can see. If you want to share your uh, board to an organization you belong to, you should click on this house icon over here. Now you have two options here. You can either select to share to all organization users. That means that every single person who is in that organization can see your board. Or you may want to select um, the other option, meaning that only a specific group will see your board. I'm gonna select this one and start writing the name of my group, which is Clanet Templates. And I'm gonna select that one. So after I save this board, this means that you can find this group in Planet Templates group. I'm going to click on Next. And in the last section, you're able to give admin rights to other organization members. So you can do that by just starting to write their name and selecting their name. And these admin admins that you add here are able to uh, add content to your group. They're able to see the analytics and tracking of um, your learners. So it's a good option if you want to co-create boards with those people. And the last thing you can do is activate a board chat, meaning that the people can, all board members can chat to each other. After this, you're actually ready. You can just publish your board. And now that you know how to create and share a board, you can practice this. So please open Clanet in a new window, create a board and either save it or share it. Thanks for watching.